Hello, Salam Alaikum. Welcome to Dr. Lange at Medcare Hospital, Sharjah. I am Dr. Muhammad Imad Alilu, specialist ophthalmologist in the ophthalmology department. I am a corneal and anterior segment surgeon with more than 25 years of experience. And I would like today to welcome our team in the ophthalmology department, Dr. Atif, our retina surgeon. Hello, Dr. Atif. Alaykum How are you doing? Alaykum salam wa barakatuh. And uh, our uh, experienced uh, oculoplastic surgeon, Dr. Fairuz. Hi, Dr. Imad. Hello, Hi, Dr. hello, Dr. Fairuz. How are you nice doing? Nice to be here. It's and nice to hello be to here. everyone. We would like to talk about the high specialized service we are providing in Medcare Hospital Sharjah in our ophthalmology department. I am myself doing all kinds of cataract surgeries, anterior segment surgeries, cornea surgeries, and providing the ocular surface disease management. Dr. Atif is doing the retina surgeon, right, Dr. Atif? Yes. I, so I what kind of surgery you are providing here in Medcare Sharjah? Uh, basically, we do retinal surgeries, all sorts of retinal surgeries including uh, vitrectomies for any diabetic disorders, injections for any diabetic retinopathies, for vein occlusions, for age-related macular degenerations. We also do treatment for uh, retinopathy of prematurity, Dr. Iman. So, Dr. Fairuz, uh, what, what surgeries you are usually providing here in Medcare Sharjah? So, as far as oculoplasty is concerned, um, it deals with plastic surgery of the eye to make it very, very simple. So anything from uh, defects of the eyelid, you know, it can be birth defect, it can be an acquired defect, it can be droopy eyelids, you know. Uh, so these are the functional things that we do. As the age progresses, although we become more wiser, but there are certain changes which happens in and around the eyes, you know. You can find these extra fold of skin in the upper lid, a little bit of a baggy eyes in the lower lid, which most of the people have. and. Uh, Sometimes it is definitely a concern, so I deal with that also. Well, that's, that's, yes. that's a great. I think it's become more uh, and more necessary it is, in our yeah. modern lifestyle. Right. Dr. Atif, I, I've heard that you have a special interest in diabetic eye care. Yes, uh, diabetes is one of the most uh, common causes of blindness in the world. Uh, since it's my, special, it's my specialization, I, I deal with a lot of diabetic uh, retinopathy cases whether it's medical management in terms of injections or in terms of laser, or even surgical managements where people have uh, may end up with vitreous hemorrhage, or, or even for the, for the matter where they have sometimes fractional retinal detachments where they require uh, pro, uh, surgeries which may be prolonged. Uh, and uh, we try our best to give them the best of the results. What I know about Dr. Imad is uh, he has this magical hands of giving a spectacle-free life to anyone with you know who has been using a lot of well uh, refractive yeah. yes yeah. Uh, uh, refractive yeah. surgery we are uh, providing this service since more than 20 years now right. and refractive surgery i think has been touched the life of millions all over Absolutely, the world yeah. right now we are lucky to have this latest technology yeah. of uh, femto smile uh, we have added to our armamentarium along with all uh, the other uh, different techniques in correcting vision right. and getting rid of the glasses. So what about Dr. Fairuz? I mean, uh, yeah, apart, I thought you also do uh, um, reconstruction or vital reconstruction post-trauma and, uh, and deal with ocular oncology as well and the sense of uh, cancer of the eyes. Yeah. So which is uh, in, in this part of the world is, is uh, I mean, uh, we, we are very fortunate to have you around because not many people deal with this. I do agree. It's a very, very niche speciality as an orbital surgeon or an eye cancer specialist. Uh, so in orbital reconstruction, we deal with trauma. If there is a fracture in the eye, I mean fracture in and around the bones, uh, we deal with that. Uh, we have many modern implants and stuff and things have changed in the recent past. Uh, so, uh, when it comes to a trauma, uh, there are minor traumas, there are major traumas. So, there are very unfortunate situations where, you know, uh, as an orbital surgeon, of course, you deal with the orbit, but then uh, they might have lost an eyeball, you know, like um, it's a very psychological, bad psychological impact for a patient. It 
definitely turns around the life if we can you know reconstruct the entire phase and you know they can go into the society uh, for a better quality of life so it's like step by step dealing in all aspects with the fracture with the eyeball with the prosthesis and everything so it's very satisfying I'm really proud to work uh, with my colleagues as a one team and uh, we are looking forward uh, more and more to see our patients happy and smiling not only by providing smile surgery <laughs> but by doing all kinds of surgeries which make them happy and satisfied. Interview one, take one. Dr. Atif, um, sorry, Imad. <laughs> <laughs> And then you can cut it. <laughs> you can cut and paste. It's over. We have done. <laughs>